tiny uh, uh, thumbnail, I'd say, but uh, just just so exquisite, I simply had to share this guy. Uh, perched on a matrix of uh, a dolomite, we have this lawn of tiny dog teeth of cobalt and calcite with a dusting of colwezite around the side. Now, I think the the, the uh, there is a pretty good idea of the actual specimen. Slightly overexposed, as you're seeing it here. You can see the dog tooth formation of the uh, cobalt and calcites. From a display point of view, you'd have it on a stand like this, going around like that, so an all-round view, all the way around. And then looking from the top down, this fruity, lovely section. Uh, this would hail from, some may say Tanker from Gurumu. My, my source tells me we're looking at from Mashamba West. So a little bit of uh, a lack of clarity as to the provenance of this guy. Um, but uh, uh, yeah, quite a lovely, lovely little piece. All the way from the Katanga Copper Crescent, the, the Copper Mines of the Congo. This we know for sure. Look at that. Ah, lovely. It's not a large piece, but really, really quite impressive. Lovely color, this rich uh, gem uh, pink going into a well. What would this color be with this dusting of the little Kulwezad crystals? Uh, rarity, of course, from the Katanga even. Uh, nine deposits worldwide for this material.